welcome back to the cheer sis. Today we're gonna teach you how to do some beginner gymnastic tricks. Let's get started stretching. So for our first stretch, we're gonna stretch our head. So how do you stretch your hand? You get your left hand and you pull your head to the left side. And you hold it for five seconds. One, two, three, four, five. Now the now other we're side. Gonna one, two, three, four, five. Now we're gonna pull our head backwards. One, two, three, four, five. Now forwards. One, two, three, four, five. And now we're gonna twist our head in circles. One, two, three, four, five. Now we're gonna go the other way. One, two, three, four, five. And that's the end of stretch one. Second. Part of stretching, we're gonna sit in a wide straddle. straddle. We're gonna put our hands up in fox ears and we're gonna bend to one side and hold it for five seconds. One, two, three, four, five. five. The, now, other side. the other side. One, two, three, four, five. Now we're gonna do the middle and hold that for five seconds too. One, two, three, four, five. And that's the end of part two. For the third stretch, we are gonna stretch our wrists and ankles. So first we're gonna do our wrists. So we're gonna get our hands. We're gonna put it down on the floor and we're gonna kneel backwards. I mean forwards, yeah. One, two, three, four, five. And now we're gonna twist our hands the other way. And then we're gonna kneel backwards. One, two, three, four, five. And now we're gonna circle our wrists. One, two, three, four, five. Now we're finished stretching our wrists. And we're gonna stretch our ankles. So we're gonna circle our ankles both ways. Two times. One, two, the other way, one, two. And that's the end of part three of so stretching. For the Four, Four, last stretch, we're gonna do a cat pose, a child pose, and a, a seal stretch. stretch. And we're all gonna hold that for five seconds. So first we're gonna do a seal stretch. So we're gonna lay down and we're gonna knock put our hands and feet apart. Wide. We're gonna put it, their feet together and hold it for five seconds. One, two, three, four, five. Now we're gonna do our cat pose. One, two, three, four, five. Now for the last thing, we're gonna do a child pose. One, two, three, four, five. And that's the end of, of stretching. Let's get started Let's with do doing the hands tricks. Hands. First few tricks, all you need to know is how to do a handstand. So now I will show you the first, first trick. trick. We're gonna go into a handstand, then we're gonna pop with our hands. So you guys probably should see out my hands first. So you see how my hands pop. So when I do a handstand, before I do that, I pop. We we'll try again. Wait, I'll show you guys my wrists again and my hands. Okay. Hit a handstand. And then we'll try again. And now, after this, I will show you guys how my feet look. Okay, and now I will show you guys my feet. So, I'll do it again. Okay. One more time. So that's the first the trick. trick, is to walk in a handstand. And again, all you need to know how to do is a handstand. So I will show you my hands and wrists first, and then I will show you guys how my feet look while I walk in my handstand. So I go here. I hope you guys saw how I did that. And now guys, I will show you my feet. <laughs> I'll do one more.
and also just saying guys if you were wondering what that is that's the cat house we showed you guys and the shorts and it's kind of class because of the rest the third trick is gonna be a little bit more harder for those of you guys that thought that was a little bit too easy you guys have to, have to try this one because it's a little bit harder so what you do is you sit in this pose then what you do is you bounce up and then you go in the hand set I'll check it a hand set and then you go down two more and the last one so that's and trick three and, and four as you you know you don't normally jump just up and you like you you just don't jump like this you jump like this and then you do that okay yeah, yeah. so bad for the trick we're gonna do a headstand then we're gonna snap down and we're gonna pop two times with our hands okay so we're gonna hit a handstand then we're gonna snap down to the front support and then pop pop so I will show you I will show you guys how to do it a little bit quicker because that was just a little bit slower for you guys to see what to do. I'll do one more. So that's the end of trick four. Trick, trick five is a little bit harder. It's trick four and trick three combined together. So it's basically swinging up, doing a handstand, then going down and popping. So I'll show you guys what I mean by that. So we're gonna go here. I'm gonna do two more, if you guys didn't understand what to do. Okay, down. One more. and then roll so you don't fall flat two more one more you guys can probably see how i'm putting my head down first oh that one's really bad i'm gonna try one more because that one was easy okay and as you guys probably saw I didn't bend my knees and my feet. I was supposed to not stay straight, but I was supposed to bend my knees. So you guys should bend your knees and not make your knees straight. And that's trick six. Trick seven involves a cartwheel. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna do a cartwheel, then you're gonna do a handstand in the middle, and then you're gonna try and put one hand to the side, and then you're gonna put the leg in front and land with the leg in front and you started with. So now I will show you guys that. I'll put it a little bit lower so you guys see what I mean. Okay, so I'll show you. I'm gonna go into a cartwheel, hands in, and I always start with my left foot, so I should land with my left foot when I do a cartwheel twist. I'm gonna do two more. Landed with my le left leg. And one more. Okay, so that's trick seven. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> okay, that should be in there. Trick. Trick. We're gonna do a handstand. A cartwheel on one hand. Yeah. And we're gonna do three of those. So, let's just go and do the first one. You guys probably see how she bends her hand, so you guys should do that too because we don't want her hand to be in the way. Now the second. Good job. Now the last third one. 
Good job. And that's the end of trick the eight. The ninth and almost last trick is for all the fans of karate. My sister will do a roll, forward roll, with one leg. So she's gonna do three of those. So you're just doing a forward roll, except you don't do it with two feet, you do it with one foot. Okay. Woof, wow, you look really strong. Okay, two more. Make sure to do it on a nice and bouncy surface so you don't hit yourself that much. Okay. That's really sharp and nice. And one more last one. Good job. So that's trick nine. Ten and last trick for this video is gonna be a trick which is a little bit more advanced. You don't need to know how to do a back wheel cover or a front wheel cover, but it's something in the middle of both. So what we're gonna do is put our hands up in the box here. Then we're gonna go here, do a pretty bridge, one leg, and kick. We're gonna do two more of those, but I'm gonna do it I'm going to do it a little bit quicker because I was just showing you guys how to do it a little bit slower. And yeah, so that was the 10th and last Thanks. Thank you for watching this gymnastic beginner's trick video. Make sure to smash that like button, subscribe, and share this video to anyone you want. Bye! See you soon!